What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Stephanie. Today, I partnered with Warby Parker to show you what kind of makeup I like to wear with glasses. I have to say, glasses are my absolute favorite accessory, and of course, the kind of makeup you wear can really switch up a look. So today, I'm gonna show you three different pairs of glasses with three different makeup looks. If you wanna see more videos such as these, please make sure to subscribe below. Come join the sisterhood, no matter your true pronoun or gender identity. Come join the family. All right, let's get started. We are starting it off with my clear colorless frames. For all these looks, I already have my face and brows done. I like to wear a bit of heavier eye makeup with clear frames, so we are putting a base down of this ColourPop Super Shock Shadow in sequin. This is a beautiful golden bronze with sparkle, and I am placing that all over the lid as well as under the lash line. I am then diving into my Too Faced Peanut Butter and Honey Palette and grabbing some peanut butter to blend up into my crease, and also I place a bit of that underneath my lash line. Now for the star of this look, this Stila Magnificent Metals Liquid Eyeshadow in Bronze Bell. I'm just placing it on my eyelid and carefully patting it in with my finger. I make sure not to bring it up too much into my crease so when my eyes are open, it's not that visible, but when I blink, there's just a flash of sparkle. Add some mascara and this eye look is complete. You can really go in any direction in terms of lip color with this eye, but I decided to go neutral this time around. Here I am using the Nude Sticks Gel Color in Pulse. This is a great moisturizing pinky nude. For me, this is one of the colors I can throw on without a mirror, but it really rounds out the look. And that's pretty much it. A lot of times glasses can weigh down the face, but because these are clear, there's a lightness to them, which allows makeup underneath to really shine through. Round glasses like these Milton frames are so popular right now, so for this look, we are going with a trendy mustard eye and a dark lip. Starting off with the base of the Makeup Forever Aqua XL in M40. I'm just placing that on my eyelid, bringing it up slightly above my crease, and you wanna work with this stuff really fast because it can set quickly. Then we are going in again with the Too Faced Peanut Butter and Honey Palette and grabbing Honey Buns, which we are gonna sweep all over the Aqua XL and up into the crease. This would be so pretty with just some upper eyelash mascara, but we are going to work on the lower lash line this time around with the Marc Jacobs Highliner Gel Crayon in Mari, which is this yellowy gold with shimmers. And we're placing that in the waterline and also smudging into the lash line. And then we're gonna go back with the honey buns on top of that as well. Add some mascara and the eye look is complete. This would look great with a neutral lip, but we are going dark for this one. So starting off with some lip liner, we have the Makeup Forever Aqua Lip in 13C, and there it is. Now we're going in with a Too Faced Melted Matte Liquid Lip in Drop Dead Red, and we are filling in those lips. To me, this is the kind of look that complements wireframes because they're so classic. They look great with something that's simple, yet at the same time unique in color. I now own four pairs of Warby Parker frames and I absolutely love all of them. The pricing is so reasonable. These glasses start at $95, including prescription lenses. And the lenses include anti-glare and anti-scratch coatings. They're just great frames overall. It drives me crazy. Finally, we have these Ames frames. This is the style that really made me fall in love with wearing glasses, and we're going real classic soothing sister with this look. Starting off with a light brown from ColourPop called Bel Air. We're just gonna add some depth to the eyes, placing it in the crease, lid, as well as the lower lash line. Going in with my new favorite liquid eyeliner from LA Colors, we're doing a classic cat eye. I cannot believe I found this at the dollar store. If you haven't seen that video, I will put in a card. I do a full face of dollar store and Daiso products and it is surprisingly successful. Throw on some mascara and the eye look is complete and we're gonna add a red lip. First we apply the Makeup Forever Lip Liner in 40. <laughs> and then we go in with the Milk Makeup Lip Color in OG Red. This is an awesome classic bright red. Again, this is a wonderful look on its own, but if you can see, my eyelids are pretty uneven right now, and that is where glasses come in so handy, especially if you're doing liner, because they really hide makeup mistakes along with wonky eyelids. This might be some of my best advice for super rush makeup days, just throw in some glasses and people won't really see your makeup mistakes. In any case, I love this look. It's completely timeless. 
All right, y'all, I hope this video gave you some inspiration for makeup looks to wear with your glosses. If you would like to try a pair of your own Warby Parker frames, they have a free home try-on program with no obligation to buy. You get five pairs of glasses for five days. Shipping is free and includes a prepaid return shipping label. And of course, the wonderful thing about Warby Parker is that for every pair of frames that you buy, a pair is given to somebody in need. So if you wanna head over to warbyparker.com slash soothing sister, link is down below in the description. You can get your own home try-on right now. Thanks so much again to Warby for partnering with me in this video. If you want to see more videos such as these, please make sure to subscribe below. Come join the sisterhood and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye!